In this video, I will show you how to use your mouse buttons, movements, and scroll wheel to simulate a key press of a keyboard. Basically you will be able to use your mouse in games that have no support for mouse. Each of your interaction with your mouse will simulate a particular key press as you can see on the screen right now. So, let's start this. First of all, you need to subscribe to my channel if you have not done it till now. That's really important, so, please subscribe to my channel. Guys, I would also like to inform you that if you have any tech related queries or questions, you can ask me in the comments section below. And I will try to answer those for you. Alright, now, I have given a link to mouse and keyboard mapping utility in the description that brings you to this page. In this page, you will get the latest version of the tool that I made for this purpose. Scroll down to assets here and click on this mouse to keyboard map exe and the download will start. Once the download is finished, your browser may try to block this file as it's unrecognized by it. Click on this arrow here and then click keep. Now click on this arrow and then click show in folder. Now you can close your browser if you want. And here is the downloaded file. Double click to run this and this time Windows Defender may block it saying that it's unrecognized. Click on more info here and then click run anyway. And you will get a tool tip that says mouse mapping is off. Press F1 to toggle mouse mapping on and off. Press F2 to exit from this utility. That's an instruction on how to use this. I will now show you how it works. I will open notepad to show you a demo. This tool tip is still here. So, now I will press F1 and the mouse cursor will vanish and a new tool tip will appear saying that mouse mapping is turned on. Press F1 to toggle mouse mapping on and off. Press F2 to exit from this utility. This tool tip will vanish after few seconds. Now, if I move my mouse, some letters will be typed as you can see. I am just randomly moving my mouse and these letters are being typed. Now if I move my mouse only forward, mostly, the letter, I will be typed. That means moving the mouse forward is like pressing and releasing the I key repeatedly. Similarly, if I move it backward, it's like pressing and releasing the K key repeatedly. Similarly by moving the mouse towards left side it's the letter J that is typed and the letter L is typed on moving the mouse towards right. Now if you press the left mouse button, it will type the letter U. And pressing the right mouse button will type the letter O. Now I will press enter to go to some new lines and now, I will scroll the mouse wheel. If I scroll the wheel up, the cursor goes up and if I scroll the wheel down, the cursor goes down. That's because scrolling the wheel up and down is like pressing and releasing the up arrow key and down arrow key respectively. Now if I press the middle mouse button, number 8 is typed. So the middle mouse button acts like the 8 key in the keyboard. So I think you understood that the mouse buttons work just like shown in this figure. And this figure is for the scroll wheel and movement of the mouse. And by setting the controls in the game accordingly, you will be able to use the mouse in games that have no support for mouse. All you have to do is set the controls for the key that is pressed for the mouse button that you want to use. Now press F1 to turn off this mouse mapping and you will get this tool tip that it's turned off, the cursor will reappear and the mouse will work normally. This tool tip will not disappear until you press F2 to exit or F1 turn it on again. So press F2 to exit and it will disappear. That's it guys, I have shown you how to map you mouse buttons, movements, and scroll to keys of your keyboard. Thanks for watching and press the like button if it helped you and don't forget to subscribe.